And now it's time for a little conflict between us and the Democratic Technate of Waka. Cool. Uh, we should do probably pretty fine here, but we probably should continue just following more people because why not Prince Albert's privateers? We could use more population. We could use more love. Yeah, love is great. Yeah, and let's go in. Everyone's going in together. One like one big old happy family. Whether they like it or not, they're all going to die here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And then we got to deal with these guys. I think that'd be a good thing to end this campaign with eventually, just to take these guys out. Obviously, we're not going to try to go too far, but you know, we'll see what we can do. Uh, as we are, of course, fi finalizing artifacts right now. Um, one, just in case, do it forever, basically. Basically, do it until you die. That'd be nice. I just hope we're going to get more army XP, maybe some special forces, stuff like that. We just killed off more divisions. So far, not bad. Pretty good, I'd have to say. Send more special forces in there, that'd be great. And I'll take that tile, thank you. And I'll take your capital too, thank you. And that should be it for them. Thank you. Making ourselves big and bold. Alright, so I got some waterways around here. Which is alright. You guys go there, you guys go here. You guys go over here, and then you guys do that. Oops. Somewhere around here. There you go. And in the meantime, go ahead and train anyways, because you'll probably need to. Um, fastest refugees, no, we're okay for now. No one really wants to come up here, which makes sense. It's really probably cold up here. That's alright. Um, still have 2.41 political power every day, which is nice. As we're finalizing our defenses. Um, I can't remember what I read from yesterday, but transportation vehicles? Multiple personal transportation vehicles are in use throughout our cities, and it would be a shame to not put this one to use. A joint demand for design proposals and mechanical studies into those machines will give ideas to our own engineers. Probably using improved motorized designs for our troops. Scavenging teams. Improved motorization means we can equip our scavenging teams with personal vehicles, let them conduct their crucial activities much further from our population centers, and amass more, criti or more critical material and resources to bring back. Efforts should be made towards a full motorization as soon as possible to maximize their efforts. Vehicles of War. While lightly armored motorized units are a good way and cheap way to increase the speed of our units, they lack protection. We cannot reasonably send such vehicles oops, my bad, um, into frontline combat, research into armoring schemes, and improve suspension of design should allow us to create armored transports, able to withstand small arms fire and provide troops, uh, support for troops, and of course, think tank. <coughs> Even though we will make sure our research team will never have any of our scientific endeavor again, or never name them again. Such a pun hides investments and efforts towards developing tracked vehicles. Heavily armored and armed, they can turn the tide of battle, or turn the tide during a stalemate, or form the centerpiece of our defense systems. So, so says, uh, one of the comments from yesterday was, why wealthy and not advanced? Well, I don't know. I'm here just for the show, pretty much. As we're going to continue trying to core more stuff, too. too. Uh, that's not bad. Actually, that's pretty good to core. Go and core that one. Um, so, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, not bad. Better planes, just please. We need more factories, though. Last patrol. Um, you know what? Save me at all times from here on out. Could really use more infrastructure, though. Yeah. Here, take that tile. Oops. That's not. A, that's not a civvy. I mean, that's not a milli. There you go. You go to the top. Nice. How many more days do we have left? A mere less than two weeks. Uh, improved medical research. As the overall situation improves and our researchers have access to more and more resources, we need to think of practical technology that will benefit both our people and our, of course, our armed forces. For a and a further enhancement medical technology will save the lives of many militia members and let our systems enjoy longer as well as more fulfilling lives. <coughs> Chemistry lab. Specialized chem labs provided with every available chemicals at their disposal and staffed with trained personnel have experience in fuel and medical manufacturing. Should increase the cost of providing a variety of equipment to our troops, such as medicine, explosive compounds, or flammable materials. Yes, please. It's up to them. We're still just trying to build up a bigger armor for these guys, so let's do that. You know, get one more. At least one more. Lannis is failure. Lannis seems to fail every single campaign now. I don't understand why. So it doesn't make any sense to me, but whatever. And let's stop training. Jacob, that guy looked really cool. Ooh, H&H. I love H&H. It's probably one of my favorite one. Um, if we come over here. Oh, we have Arcjet. Arcjet is pretty good, especially when we have a... Uh, Bonus to cast, ground attack, reliability, and agility. But this is really good too because you get more construction speed and industry technology research speed too. So I really, really, really like that one. Looks like you guys can go in and do well. Duck Lake. 
Do we really have a lot of ducks? Oops, hold on. Oh, god dang it. I thought I grabbed the other poop. Dang it. There we go. Should be able to do fine there. Bad them buckaroos. Some radar, yes please. And they'll get across just fine. Um, we're missing some portable radios, but what else is new? Air Force it. Infantry should do okay here. There we go. Go in there too. There you go. There you go. I want you three to go here, there, around. There you go. Good Redding. Red Wing. I'd probably pronounce it Redding. But Red Wing. Nice. Oh, I wanted them to actually take that or whatever. Where's the capital? Oh, L'Orange? La Never mind. There they go. Perfectures are ours. Just in time for these guys. Thanks. Uh, I might just do this now and get a different field marshal. Um, we'll see though. Let's see. Abedin. Um, just because we will go to war with these guys next as well, probably. For now, it's fine. I include you in here as well, but it's fine. All right. So far, this has been a pretty, pretty good campaign. Not, not too difficult. Maybe except in the beginning a little bit. Get a little more max planning done. We get another air base, which is great. Got a few fighters, a few cast members. Cast members? Hmm. I wanted to wait to get one of these guys. We're already on this one, so that's actually fine. Let's grab you and promote you if you can. Nice. We've got time for it. Ah, it's a Lux Demise. Oh, they're forcing the defense. Oh, do we lose it? No. Okay. I thought we lost the division. Oh, boy. Be pretty costly to do this. It makes sense for them to do it, though. You're going to do a force attack. You actually get more breakthrough, but you take way more damage. <coughs> so, for the front, we have enough political powers. Or, I mean, we have enough war support, so let's get the political power. That'd be great. Look at that. Really weak now. Twelve guys there. Special forces. We got commando, forcers, fire teams. Experienced soldiers lost would not be bad. Spec ops, yeah. Attack and defense is very good. Even more army XP if you can. But the Big Book of Science. We found a curious collection of books named the Big Book of Science in remarkably good condition. They seem to deal with anything from chemistry to electronics. But the most interesting addition, and the one we found the best day, was dealing with the internal design of pre-war robotic household assistance. This could be pretty good use. Let's get on Robco equipment. A pre-war company known under the name of Robco operated in the field of personal and military robotics before the bombs fell. Scavenging the regional centers of manufacturing plants should give us insight into their design philosophy and prove our own mechanical units at the same time with streamlined designs. Sounds like a good idea. Um, this guy's only like two things on them. I do want to throw on more to things like recon probably, but we don't have en enough for too much uh, and mobile fortifications. So we're almost done with this stuff here too. It's very nice. Radar takes forever to get enough of. Losses two hundred versus a thousand, not bad. Yeah, we've got time too, so. Dundurn? Sure, why not? If we can. Ah, oh, you scummy suckers. Good. Your duck like. Nice. What a great name. Allen Hills, thank you very much. Bye bye, Felix. Division attacks, max attachment. Agile, he's inspirational. He's a field marshal, he uh, likes to attack. Beloved leader is not bad, too. Yeah. Um, there's quite a few actual open waterways here. So let's go with you here. Like that. That was a cup of coffee, coffee or two to keep us nice and warm. 
But as we're waiting, let's see. Fire, fire protection. Even though ad hoc firefighting units have formed over time to deal with domestic fires, we should dedicate time to capture us forming specialized brigades to deal with this problem. Doing so will make our population feel safe in the face of larger industrial blazes and give us the ability to rapidly recover from strategic damage. Police protection. Our militias have worked tirelessly to secure our cities and make our citizens feel safe, and they do an admirable job being well known locally and thus trusted. Most persons seek to damage buildings behind front lines, and most foreign police units are able to deal with them. Small arms training, interrogation tactics, and urban warfare knowledge will make them deadly against anyone trying to hide. Absolutely. Because you're not going to hide from me. I will find you. And that's a promise. Saws would be good. You look how weak infantry is. There's was it just one division, two divisions trying to attack one of these guys, and even though they can pierce some, it's still not enough. It's very annoying. So we might be here for a while trying to take these guys out, but we'll see. You do that. You help out. In the meantime, we can core a lot more, hopefully. Um, there's not any big population centers. That's good to core for like resources and such. Nope. Pay your dues. I'd love to attack here, but that's a few too many divisions. So let's take a look how much manpower they have. Two to three thousand. Not bad. <clears throat> Medical protection. During the scavenging of Rockwell facilities, we've found an interesting experimental model of the so-called Mr. Gutsy. Designed to both provide advanced battlefield surgery and self or self-defense during medical operations, its design can help us work towards both better medicine suited to the front line and improve robotic designs. Construction uh, protection. Establishing rebuilding protocols and constructing or constructing our infrastructure with redundant strong points allows us to recover faster after structural damage, and thus regain strategic mobility and manufacturing capabilities in a short amount of time and tato farmers. <clears throat> Organizing a deeper farming system relying on a simple backyard gardens. Well, every family to feed themselves to a small extent, lessening the strain on our agricultural system and letting our population grow with their supply, food supply. Brahmin herders. Brahmin feeding and herding, learned from traders using them in their commercial convoy, will give our population a sizable increase in food stock from both the milk as well as meat, which is enough to feed the entire small villages for weeks. Using every part of the Brahmin and recipes and practical applications will increase it even further.
there we have it, everybody. We didn't get the bank and bandits or the Ford cap hack, but whatever. It is what it is. I spent a lot of time doing this off, I guess, on screen with the time lapse, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous, tremendous trust of your day.